Hi, my name is Tara. And I'm Grace. And here and at Elmwood, we're going to teach you how to make a survey, collect information, and, and turn, turn it into, into an infographic. So the first thing I'm going to show you how to do is to open Google Drive, and then to create a form. First thing you do on the, oh, we're just going to choose the default theme, and then you have to make a title. Energy and Cars Questionnaire. Now, you have to write the question, which is, if you bought a car and do not have to consider its cost, which type of car would you buy? You add the options. Yes. Electric or no car. Then when you're finished, you click done. Then you click the arrow to add an item. And there are multiple choices to choose from different styles of questions, but we're just going to choose multiple choice like the question above. Then you type in the next question. Then you type in the options and click done. Once you're finished, you can send it you can send the form to anyone you like, so just go from send from via email and you can enter anyone's name who you want to send it to. So I will send it to Matt Pearl. Or you can just copy this link and you can share it via Google, Facebook, or Twitter or Schoology. So send and that's how you send your form. Now that we have sent out the questions, we have a bunch of responses. You can click on Summary of Responses. And as you can see, they give us nice, easy-to-read pie charts. And we can tell that almost half of the people would buy a hybrid car, and that most people know what biofuels are. Now that you've seen your responses, you can create an infographic. To create, to create an infographic, you click on Create, and you pick Drawing. So you want to title your drawing. I'm going to title it Electric Car. Okay. Then you want to take the information from your questionnaire, and you want to bring it into your drawing. So you can copy the information you got, and then paste it. And sometimes you have formatting problems, so I will just erase that. that. So now you want to add drawings. So what you can do is press this little drawing of a mountain that says image underneath. You press it, and then you can search what you want an image of. So I want an image of a car. So I search that. So maybe I want a cartoon car, so I'll search cartoon car. And we'll see what pops up. So we can use this car for instance. So click this, select, you just press where you want it, and then you can make it either bigger or smaller. So you just bring this and you can pull it in if you want it smaller, or pull it out if you want it bigger. So since hybrid got the biggest amount, I'll make the car biggest for hybrid. You, I'll just drag it up to where hybrid is, make it a bit smaller. So it's the biggest for hybrid. And then, since gas, uh, the electric is the next biggest, I'll insert another photo of the same car. But this time, I'll make it smaller because it was, it was a smaller amount of people who said that. So 
I'm going to make the electric car half the size because its amount of how many people would buy it is less than how many people will buy the hybrid car by half. As you can see, I made one in the past, and so I have my question at the top, and here I have the answers of hybrid, 49%, electric, 25%, gas, 22%, and no car, 4%. As you can see, the, as the biggest number is at the top, and I made its car the biggest, and it went down in numbers, and the cars kept getting smaller due to how the numbers were. As you can see, using Google is an easy way to make a survey and collect information. And using, info, using an infographic is, an, is the most interesting and exciting way to show your information. Thank, Thank you! you.